like and subscribe, and you'll have amazing luck for the rest of the week. The smallest fishes in the world. Today, we'll venture into the creatures that live in the most dominant place in the world. In the vast waters of the world, lurk the tiniest species of fish. I would recommend that you have your microscope close, because some of these fish are almost invisible. Stay tuned. I've noticed that most of you watching this aren't subscribed yet, so if you do like the video, please consider hitting that subscribe button. It's absolutely free, and you can always change your mind later. And with that said, enjoy the video. Number 7. Yellowhead Jawfish The Caribbean is a perfect destination for such a remarkable fish to exist in. The yellowhead jawfish measures around 4 inches long and boasts a fantastic blend of yellow and blue colors. This species is commonly found in Florida coral reefs. This pretty-looking, minute fish is actually a carnivore and survives on what the sea offers to him. Though the fact that this little guy only grows up to 4 inches, they tend to seek shelter deep in the waters where traffic is a bit light. If you want to own one of these fish, it'll cost you just a few bucks, but you should make sure that you follow the instructions on the conditions this species can survive in. They're quite a sensitive breed and require extra care. It'll take a keen eye to be able to catch a glimpse of this fish. Their light blue tail camouflages well with the water. Besides being kind of aggressive to other sand sifters, they're pretty much good guys. Just feed them correctly. The nightlife in the ocean seems like a colorful place to view. Next up, we'll feature one of those famous fish that keep the water bright and beautiful. Its neon tone skin is just one of many features of the neon goby. Stay tuned as we dig through the tale of this remarkable fish. Number 6. Neon Goby, the King of the Caribbean Waters Just as the name suggests, the Neon Goby is a party freak itself, equipped with a neon-like strike spread out over its body. It originates mainly in the Gulf of Mexico and the Caribbean. The tiny creature grows to a maximum length of just 2 inches. An average male index finger is over 4 inches double the size of this little guy. Scientists do put their curiosity to work because who would think that these gems live deep in water? This fish is part of a larger family that probably has a larger population than the human race. You have to plan a day in your life to get to the coastal regions and see them for yourself. If you think this species is small, wait until you see the Corfu Dwarf Goby. You'll be shocked. Number 5. Corfu Dwarf Goby how do these even survive? Reaching less than an inch long are the Corfu Dwarf Gobies, originating from Corfu Island. This creature is quite small, with their male species being even smaller. The male counterparts are a deliberate example of the true Greek legend from their size of about 0.87 inches. They're so small that it would be annoying to mark their length on a ruler. Before coming across this tiny creature that deserves its own Guinness Book of Record award, the smallest known measurement is half an inch. Before recent findings back in 2014, this ancient species was actually presumed extinct because they hadn't been seen for a long while. Imagine finding something that was last seen in the late 1900s. Wouldn't that be awesome? Nine species were discovered in the Croatia Lagoon therefore reassuring the existence of these breathtaking creatures. Number 4. Stout Infant Fish If you can see this fish, then you probably have a very good set of eyes, because not everyone can. This species exists at a depth of 15 to 30 meters in coral reef lagoons and grows to almost 0.3 inches long. This native Australian breed has an interesting narrative about the low rate of specimens ever even being collected. You know this fish has to be small if well-equipped researchers are having a hard time capturing them. What makes it even more difficult to see is it lacks pigmentation and is transparent when they're alive. Besides being nearly invisible to the eye, this species also feeds on microorganisms. The stout instant fish is amongst the latest of discoveries of marine animals, and there's very little to no information known about them. Sadly, this breed of fish lives a very short amount of time only managing to see about 60 days during a lifetime. Surprisingly, there's a lot of competition for the smallest fish in the world, don't you think? This next one, I wouldn't suggest you pet or touch. There's no fun in petting something that you won't see until its demise. Number 3. The Tiniest of Them All 
Photocoronis spiniceps. We now shift our attention to an animal with a clingy male species who spends the bigger portion of their lives attached to their female counterparts. Talk about an unhealthy relationship. This fish is not so pleasing to look at, and many have termed the Photocoronis spiniceps to be the tiniest fish in the world. And they made no mistake, the male grows up to about 0.24 inches long, making it darn near microscopic. Its tiny size, though, might not reflect its vicious habit. Don't be fooled, it's among the predator family. Not being blessed by size means different adaptivity to lure in unsuspecting prey. With the help of a bioluminescent organ, it deceives its prey to approach. Once close enough, it pounces on it with an elastic mouth. Aside from being the smallest vertebrate of all, these fish deserve to be amongst the weirdest. Just judging from its very distinctive form and appearance, imagine coming face to face with a tiny fish with a big head. Number 2. Elegant Firefish Do you know any ways to be a proper lady? I'm sure you could come up with a lot of ideas and go on and on, but I doubt you have an idea on how to be a proper fish. Well, the elegant purple fish is here to teach you. This fish sure looks like it's wearing a very elegant purple dress and measures a neat 3 inches in length. That's why they're a fan favorite amongst aquariums. They steal the show pretty much every single time. These elegant fish are commonly found in the Indo-Pacific region, around the areas of Mauritania to Samoa. They can be found at a depth of 80 to 230 feet deep. These fish also mostly move around in pairs, and that's because they live in a monogamous lifestyle and are credited for their faithfulness to their spouses. Now I'm just here hoping all these elegant firefish have good honeymoons. And with that, it's now time for today's best pick. Today's photo was sent to us by a subscriber, so if you come across a photo online and you want to know more details about it, just send it over to us. We might even feature it in our future video. Number 1. Pedocypris Carbuncles Welcome to the micro side of aquatic life. This fish is definitely one of the smallest on our list. This tiny creature right here could easily fit on the tip of your thumb. A mature male can only pass for 11 millimeters, while the females are barely 8 millimeters long. Not surprising that it's the most recent holder of the world's smallest vertebrae in the world. They pretty much deserve it. And you would think their size is the most captivating thing about them, but you'd be surprised to know it isn't. You're gonna raise your eyebrows a few times about this fish. Its unique habitat is in the black water or peated streams of Indonesia. Because you might not be familiar with the water's characteristics there, I'll let you know about it. They have the color of black tea, and they're as acidic as a bottle of cola. Most scientists say that it's nearly uninhabitable for any living creature. But don't be fooled, these streams contain 200 to 300 of these fish species. Also, it's said that the males have this superficial pelvic fin, which is marked as the most astonishing thing. Wondering what they use it for? Stay tuned, your mind's going to be blown. Their slippery and small physique was not going to be a reason that this fish couldn't get a mate. They adapted their physique and grew this unusual pelvic fin that helps it grip onto the females when they're making baby fish. Just kind of crazy, don't you agree? When you think of a story like the infamous Peter Pan, does this fish come to mind? It should be because, like Peter Pan, this fish refuses to grow to adulthood. Scientists conclude that it literally stops growing in a certain age and lives out the rest of its years as a larva. Strange, right? But this brings us to the end of our list today. If you know any other kinds of small fish that we might not have mentioned, let us know in the comments down below. 